The Division, episode one. Do, do you think she'll make it? Uh, I don't know. The delivery seems to be going hard. Do you think you can make it, Raven? Yeah, I think so. Oh, honey, please do. Our little boy has to be delivered soon. About that. From the way Raven's labor has been going, I believe it's a girl. What? What are I supposed to do with a girl? Keep it. I'm not the judge of that. Anyway, she should deliver in the next couple hours. Should I go ask El Elder Fridley? His name isn't Elder Fridley, it's Elder Moonscar, you know that. And yes, go ahead. I'm not the judge of that. <sighs> Elder Moonscar! What do you need, my young one? D d do you think that Raven's delivery will be smooth? How is she going so far? Rough. That's for sure. Pun not intended. It should be a really bad delivery, but the gods shall put that in their paws. You're great help. What? That fast? I just went to ask. I know. It was a really easy delivery, actually. Maybe the elder wasn't right, but still, my job's done here. What do you want me to do next? Retreat to your den. As you wish. What does it look like? It's... It has green eyes. I thought that's what... What's what you... Blah, blah, blah. <sighs> I thought that's what you wanted. You're really confused right now since you just gave birth. I did not want a green-eyed, brown, worthless piece of poop. Throw it in the river. I will not. I worked too hard to deliver this young pup. And then we'll do something about it. Give her away to other territories. They'll say no, too. It has our scent on it. And then wash it off eventually. It'll have my scent on it even more if I do so. Fine, I'll think something to do with it. Besides, keep it. He won't get rid of you, little baby. I swear to you that. A couple of minutes later. Okay, I found a solution to our little problem. Such as? We need to kill it. Somehow, some way. That makes it look like we didn't have anything to do with it. For the last time... What? What did you tell me? I told you, I'm not going to throw it in the way, you're not going to throw it in the river, you're not going to kill it. But Raven! No buts, Damien. I will not take that. We're going to keep it and raise it as our own. <sighs> God, I hate parenthood. I hate you, honestly, but... Mm. <laughs> I had some trouble with Damien. A little bit of some, yeah. I mean, guess he wants to kill it or throw it away. Yeah, pretty much. Well, what should we do? I think we should just keep it and house it as our own. If you want, I could take care of it and keep it off your paws. You could, you couldn't, you. You have all the stuff to make, arti I guess, artificial milk. Yeah, it wouldn't hurt, but still, you were the mother. It was your mistake, I guess. Where is there like a sleeping area? Conveniently, yes, there is. It's the nursery. Okay. I hope you find a snug in here. It's quite spacious. I like it, at least, and I'm sure the baby does too. Okay then, go ahead and get used to surroundings and I'll tell Damien. I guess, don't tell Damien! Why? 
because he'll come in here in the middle of the night and kill it. What makes you suspect that? Because he already doesn't want the baby as it is. <sighs> okay, then. The ones we're starting to pick up. You called me? Yeah, I think it's about ready to storm. Let me just suspect that, you weird, freaking, herb-loving dog. Smell the air. It smells like dirt. I suppose it does. What does that have to do with me? It doesn't have anything to do with you. I'm just stating the fact that it's about to rain. Okay, we need rain. So much that I honestly don't even care. Fine. The warriors, then. <laughs> okay, so, do you like the leader, honestly? Um, definitely not. No. Dude, he's a freaking jerk one. Uh, touche about that, my friend, touche. But I mean, like, he's okay from time to time. Like, I don't mind him that much, but like, still. Uh, yeah, like I said, true that, my brother, true that. <sighs> Enrique, you're just so predictable. Really? How do you think Dad felt when he had you? Oh, why you little... Ugh. Cut it out, girls. Your furs... Your furs... Both of your furs are pretty. <sighs> Let's just get some sleep. We're asleep for like five hours, though. Get some sleep. God, Dakota, okay. Yeah. Guys, don't even try to fight with Dakota, man. He's... He's the leader of the warrior, then. We do as he says, and we... We can follow his commands. And we get respected. See how easy that is? I guess so. Doesn't seem that hard anyways. I'm good at sleeping. Yeah, the only thing you're good at is sleeping and eating and running your mouth. <sighs> Sam sp speaks for you. You're my, you're my brother. Well, I mean, whenever you eat, you're, you're never full. Because no one can fill a mouth as big as yours. <sighs> Shut up. Your mouth is as big as a freaking baleen whale. Are we to sleep yet? Dude, you just left us alone like not very even like two minutes. I suppose so. Let's go sleep. Wait, do you smell that? That's part of your own farts wafting back into your face. Oh my god, no, shut up. It smells like a newborn pup. What do you think that could possibly be? Do you remember whenever, whenever Raven said that she's pregnant with, you know, Damien's baby? That she might have gave birth already. I hide the death that dude. It's been only nine months. But still, babies come out when they want to come out. Eh, I suppose so. That is a possibility. Nice hypothesis, but I highly doubt it. Eh, me as well, man. Like, it's only been nine months. Like, it has to be twelve, I'm pretty sure, before they give birth. You don't know that. Should I go check it out in the nursery? <laughs> dude, you can risk your dinner for tomorrow, but I ain't gonna do it. Oh yeah, same. Go to town, dude. Freaking pussy lala. Oh, she has. Guys, ah, ow. She has. She's gave birth. She's gave birth. Oh, really? Is a baby cute? I don't know. I think it's a boy, though. Dude, it does, doesn't smell like a boy. It smells like a girl. I mean, I'm just saying... Dude, the only reason you know how what a girl smells like is because you made it with plenty of coyotes in your life. <sighs> Shut up. That's only once, dude. <sighs> uh, yeah, right. <sighs> but don't you think that if she did give birth, Damien would have announced it already? Maybe he just doesn't care. You know Damien as well as both of us. As all of us, actually. I guess you're right about that. But, Scratch, what if he actually did... Like, what if he didn't tell us at all? I think there's something to weep but suspicious about Damien, and no one seems to even care about it. I guess except for Elder Moonscar, but he's went ahead and paced back and forth. I mean, he has some sort of crazy idea or something, dude. Dude, really, it doesn't even matter. Just go to bed and put it to rest. Probably tell us tomorrow anyways. 
She just wants to think of a nice time to tell us so that we won't act so surprised. Well, too bad for him since I already know, but... Still, dude, why would he not tell us? <sighs> Shut up, dude, it doesn't matter. Yeah, right. Okay, I'll offer you to do my own little hole and go die in it, shame. Uh, it's pretty cozy over here. You dig your own holes, dude. Yeah, that feels nice. Pretty cozy. Man, I don't even have a hole to dig into. Actually, yeah, I do. I have my own little den, actually. <laughs> I have to destroy that baby once and for all. <laughs>